In this example, we are going to be using practice exercise 11 b that can be found in your textbook on page 519. We are going to be calculating the federal income tax that needs to be withheld from a specific employee's paycheck. The example tells us that Todd Thompson's weekly gross earnings for the present week were $1,400 and that he has one exemption. They tell us to use the wage bracket that can be found in your textbook on page 497 with a $70 standard withholding allowance for each exemption. The gross earnings that they gave to us in the problem was $1,400. Gross earnings is how much an employee has earned in a pay period before any taxes or deductions have been taken away. They tell us that he has one exemption, which means that he's claiming himself on his W-4 form, which means that he can reduce his taxable income for federal tax purposes only by $70. So in order to calculate his taxable income for federal income taxes only, we would take the $1,400 that he's earned in gross earnings and we would subtract away the $70 for that exemption, giving us a taxable income of $1,330. Please note that we only will use this taxable income amount of $1,330 to calculate federal income taxes. We would not use that amount to calculate Social Security and Medicare. We need to use the wage bracket that you can find on page 497 in your textbook. This is an actual federal income tax wage bracket table. This is for someone that is a single person that gets paid on a weekly basis. How we read this table is very simple. We'll use the yellow highlighted line as the way to read it across. If our taxable income is greater than $704, but does not exceed $1,648, we need to withhold $91.40 from the employee's paycheck plus an additional 25% on any amount of their taxable income that exceeds $704. For our employee, his taxable income for federal income taxes purpose only is $1,330. Therefore, he falls on this yellow line. His taxable income is greater than $704, but does not exceed $1,648. Because he falls into this tax bracket, we have to take away $91.40 plus an additional 25% on any amount of his taxable income that exceeds $704. So the initial tax, because he falls into that tax bracket, is 91.40. He also has to pay an additional tax. And how we calculate that is we take his taxable income of $1,330 and we subtract away the lower end of that tax bracket, which was 704. That tells us 
how much of his taxable income is going to be subject to that additional 25% tax. So again, his taxable income minus the lower end of that tax bracket, he exceeds by $626. Any amount that exceed that 704 is taxed at 25%. So we take the $626 that exceeds the 704 and we multiply it by 25%. That tells us that we additionally have to take out $156.50 for federal income taxes. So in total, we take the 9140, we add to it the $156.50 for the amount that they exceeded to arrive at the total amount that has to be withheld for federal income tax purposes of $247.90.